Dubai has been breaking records again, but this time five and a half thousand kilometers away in London. Yes, the largest cranes ever built left from Shanghai in China, making their way to DP World's newest port under construction, the London Gateway. They've just arrived and will be a spectacular addition to the English capital's skyline, as Noni Edwards reports. They've been dubbed giant cranes, monster cranes, mega cranes, and how else would you describe the biggest cranes ever built? Taller than the London Eye, they almost challenge logic, being sailed into British waters. The engineering rationale for their sheer size is simple. As container ships get bigger, so must the cranes required to load and unload their cargo. Well, these cranes are very important. They're some of the largest cranes ever built in the world and the largest in the UK. And what they're here is for unloading the ships, which are then delivering the products into our container stacking area and then onto trucks and out into the consumer market. Worth $10 million and weighing 2,000 tonnes each, these three cranes are the first of 24 destined for London's newest port under construction. They've come from China on board the Zhenhua 26, destined for the Thames estuary 20 miles from the capital. The first shipment in London's multi-billion dollar deep sea port project. The London Gateway CEO is proud to be bringing their port back home, where he says it should be thanks to DP World. It's a deep sea hub port here to serve the whole of the UK. It's also Europe's biggest logistics park uh, as well. Uh, zero cost to the UK taxpayer. This is 100% private investment by DP World. The port is being built on new land in the county of Essex, using 27 million cubic metres of sand and gravel taken from the river, which is enough to fill the city's Olympic Stadium 65 times over. The delivery of the cranes marks a significant milestone for London's new port. Well, this is very important. We've got the key behind us, which is built, and now we have the equipment which we can offload from the vessel and then start our commissioning and training program to enable us to reopen in the later part of this year. With this project, the port's management are hoping to achieve nothing less than restoring London's status as a premier centre of global trade. London Gate was a massive infrastructure project in the UK. It's the biggest job creation project in the UK, 36,000 new jobs here. We're very, very big. We're three times the size of the city of London. Once complete and running at maximum efficiency, the two and a half kilometre port will be able to process three and a half million containers of freight each year and will be able to accommodate ships that are nearly half a kilometre long. Noni Edwards, Emirates News.